Hello, everyone. Um, I want to talk about uh, setting up OpenVPN in TrueNAS scale. In TrueNAS core, we have a tunable to get the network root to set it up. However, in TrueNAS scale, we don't have it. So we need to do something. And after searching in the Google, we find I found the solutions and I would like to show everyone and I group it into uh, each session so you can just follow it. First thing first, we need to go to the credential and go to the certificate. We need to set up the certificate uh, of authority in here first. Just keep any name you like in here. In my case, is this uh, root C8. This one seems OK. And just find your pace. I'm living in Hong Kong. Hong Kong organization. And the email. And the common name will be your, your forwarding DNS. Save it. After we create the CA for the open uh, open VPN server, we need to create a separate certificate for the uh, open VPN server. So credential certificate certificate, and we just give you a a name for it. We can remember surface. It's pretty much the same as uh, the previous uh, instruction we do it in the core. And lifetime, we need to see that to wood C8. And once again, see that your home country. Okay, save it. And then after we create a certificate for the uh, open uh, VPN server, we need to configure the server. So we need to go to system setting, service, and open VPN server. Yep, we need to select the certificate and the CA certificate and the internal IP for your connection. So it's much, much better if you are using different sublet for, for the another OPN, uh, another VPN uh, services. So we choose sublet using TLS script uh, auto enable. And this one, you can choose it. I just like uh, Shutter to five six cyber will be using this one a a yes compassion i don't need to compassion using udp and in the additional parameter you need to do to push the local network back to your router And again, 
simple, right? Good. After we config the OpenVPN server, we can go back service and turn it on. Turn the server on and start automatically. And we need to do something on create a certificate for the client. So we go back to the Cratenzo certificate and add a certificate. In my case, it's for me only. Since this is only my testing uh, server, so I just create for myself a uh, kind of certificate of 40 with C8 and night before Hong Kong. Hong Kong and my email and the fourteen domain is okay once it's safe. Okay, after creating a certificate for for the uh for the client we can go to enable IP forwarding by going to system setting at once uh system control and hit add warning close okay the first variable is let dot ipv4 ip forward value is one just if name you can remember for me is ip forwarding and hit save and then we need to do some uh, sources translations uh, also, it's in the in in the advanced tag in here. In need or shut down script, hit add. The description. In my case, I just let me let let rule run. There's a command. The command will be NFT. And at TIP dot let and when is pull in it and hit save. And we have several uh, script we need to add. In fact, is four. Let root two, also a command. And it's a NFT. Don't worry, I will post uh, the command line in the description. So just save it. Third rule. Rule three. Also a command is a post wood. Post wood routing. And uh, rule four, let rule four is also a command. And the access command you may be different from me because you got a different uh, network connection name. Uh, network 
connection name and the IP address may be different. You see, uh, my my server is one nine two dot one six eight one dot one dot one four zero. It may be different from you, so you need to change it and hit save. And yes, pretty much okay. After after you just reset your server, and you can open your VPN connection in other network and connect it to the true last um, scale server. Thank you.